The modifications required to the gas chromatograph when switching from helium to hydrogen as a carrier gas are related to hazards of hydrogen. Hydrogen is a flammable gas that can create an explosive atmosphere wherever it accumulates. This can be properly addressed by safety standards, ensuring no hydrogen accumulation is possible by avoiding and detecting any leak and safely venting any outlet stream. Modern GCs are able to detect leaks upstream the column by monitoring gas pressure. This can be directly used for a GC working with hydrogen. If hydrogen leaks before reaching the column, the pressure drop of the GC is negligible. Hydrogen pressure cannot build up and reach the defined set point. In this case, the control of the GC interprets the permanent difference between the operative and the set point pressure as a leak and protects the GC by shutting off the hydrogen valve. However, the safeguard cannot be efficient when the leak is downstream the column. In this case, hydrogen sensors need to be installed to detect any hydrogen accumulation in the oven. Here we have the hydrogen sensor we have installed inside the oven and the switch bulb. If the sensor detects hydrogen in the oven, it switches from hydrogen to another inner carrier like helium or nitrogen, avoiding the hydrogen accumulation in the oven and protecting the column by keeping the carrier flow. The second modification is related to safely venting any hydrogen outlet stream. These ports are the outlet of the septum perch and the split from the injector. When helium is used, it can be vented outside the lab, but if hydrogen is used as a carrier gas, these ports need to connect it to the lab's flammable vent line. As our lab was already prepared for work using hydrogen with the supply of the FID detector, no further modifications were required. As you saw, the modification to move from helium to hydrogen as a carrier gas are in a modern GC are minimal and safe. When all the hazards related to hydrogen were successfully addressed, we verified the reliability and reproducibility of the new GC configuration versus helium by a standard FID performance evaluation test. This standard consists of separating and detecting four different hydrocarbons, C13, C14, C15, and C16. As you can see in this chromatogram, better performance is obtained with hydrogen beep compared to 5 helium for the same samples. The baseline is more stable and accurate. One additional advantage of working with hydrogen as a carrier gas is the possibility to choose between improving the resolution of the analytical procedure or the speed of the sampling time compared to helium to increase the GC productivity. In summary, we are very happy with our decision to move from helium to hydrogen B for GC. It has allowed us to reduce the cost of using this analytical tool while improving its performance and reliability. As hydrogen hazards has been successfully addressed, we are enjoying the advantages of hydrogen with all the benefits it delivers.